Greetings and salutations, viewers. I'm Star Princess and Chelsea, and welcome back to the Henry Stickman series. Last time, we broke into a bank and attempted to break out of prison. Now, good old Henry's at it again, now stealing a diamond. Let's see how well this is gonna go. As the mayor, I hereby declare the Tunisian archaeological exhibit open. Oh, boy! But of course, Henry, being the greedy bastard he is, decides I'm gonna go steal that fancy diamond. Under the cover of darkness. Alright, so we have two options, busting or sneaking. Well, last time we attempted sneaking in, I think. Let's try sneaking in. At least when we were robbing the bank, we were sneaking in. Alright, so let's see, uh, double hoppers, anti-gravity cap, a teleporter, a shrink ray, a pickaxe, or a liquidificator. Hmm. I'm gonna try digging underneath. It worked well last time, right? Okay, there was a creeper for some reason. Yeah, so apparently there's something in that cake. That and, worked? Uh, he used it to escape. And then I got fired. Pretty lame, huh? Yeah, I don't really like this uh, one. Please, shut up. Oh, I just, I just, I just How did that work? Apparently creepers are a good thing. I'll have to go back and see what happens later, but for now, uh, I guess I could drop a bombshell on him. Never mind. Why would they keep live bombs in a museum? Wasn't that live? All it did was stub his toe. Oh, wait, that was sarcasm. Haha, <laughs> I get it. Alright, well, actually, how about we return to the start and actually try sneaking in this time a different direction? Since obviously, for some reason, pickaxe with creeper worked because Minecraft. Okay, let's try a shrink ray then. Worm. <laughs> uh, man, worms are so much more vicious up close. Uh, it, like, reminds me of that point in, uh, in Night at the Museum when, you know, they're trying to pop the tire and it's like this huge, massive, like, ah, and people are falling all over and then you just hear, like, this itty little squeak pull out. Uh, I'm, I'm rambling. Hang on. Okay. Jumble hoppers? <laughs> <laughs> Two points deducted. Sweet flip, bro. That's what I do. Alright, let's try the anti-gravity cap. Maybe that'll have a better luck. Wee. You're lucky. I've always wanted to go to space. Space! Maybe you'll get to see Space Core and Wheatley. Alright, let's try a teleporter. This worked out so well last time, remember? Uh. Well, I made it! Onto the roof. Yes! Huh. Okay, so we got a panty, a tranquilizer, an invisibility pill, and Falcon Punch! Falcon Punch! Never mind, only one man is capable of the Falcon Punch. And it's Captain Falcon. Alright, well, let's, uh, let's take a step back and actually see what the liquidificator does first. Yeah, I know I'm reading this, but it's like... Yeah, I love the music for this. It's just like, oh. What did you think was going to happen? I don't know. I was too busy jamming out to the music. Alright, so let's actually go through the teleporting section first and see where that leads. Which is funny considering, again, the teleporter I don't think worked for stealing the bank. Or breaking into the bank, whatever it was called. Alright, let's try a tranquilizer. 
Okay, you missed. Oh. Whoa, what are the odds of that? <laughs> Fairly good, actually. All right, let's try the invisibility pill. Yeah. It's hard to see when you're invisible. No, that makes no sense. Yeah, sure, your eyeballs will be invisible, but I would think you'd still be able to see. Oh, no, we don't really got into that whole debate. Okay, I guess we use the lucky penny. Yeah, oh, look, penny. See a penny, pick it up all day long. You'll have a good luck. Except in this case, you'll probably lose your job. Just saying. All right, so. Portal gun, yes. Oh. Oh, I'm not reading that. Okay. Wow, it's really tiny. You could just type it any tinier there. Alright, so this time we'll just try a wire? Mission Impossible, this. Oh, that was what I was supposed to do. Alright, so let's see. I guess I'll try a laser cutter. Oh. You get cut. Why you no bleed? Because I am stick. Alright, so what happens if I drop down? Ow. Did you really think that was going to work? Uh, one could dream. Alright, fine. I'll wire it down. Sticks, I can't skip these once I do them, but that's fine. Alright, so... I guess I'm gonna hammer it. So what are you gonna do with it? How's he gonna sell it, by the way? Alright. So we got a cannon, we got cheese, and we got a plank. Jeez! It's so unusual. Maybe it'll help. Uh, why? Seriously. You're the one who programmed the game. I'm just playing. Alright, fine. Cannon. You guys have nothing to say about that? You almost saved it. Almost. Alright, I guess it's the plank then. And after that, they just up and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah. Okay, so we can snap his neck. We can drop the diamond on him, I guess. Grab his rifle or just jump. I'm gonna try going stealthy on this. What? I think I ended up snapping my own neck there. Told you, man, I told you about the stairs. No, you didn't. You said Jack Diddley about the stairs. Fine, I'm just gonna grab his rifle. Wow, you are a terrible shot. Man, those first person shooters make it look so easy. I know, right? Alright, fine, I'm gonna jump on him. Or jump over him. Epic. Not so epic. I'm surprised you made it that far with that heavy diamond. That's a good question. How heavy is that thing? Alright, I guess I dropped the diamond on his head then. <laughs> Clunk. He's dead now. Yeah! I got the undetected way. Woohoo! I'm still curious about where he got the... How he was able to sell it. That's what I'd like to know. But... Uh... Yay! But that's only one ending. We still gotta see what the other endings are. Alright, so if the bombshell didn't work, then how about the plane? Uh, I gotta warn some. Oh, okay, that works. Uh. That way? Hmm. Must be a light sleeper. Alright. Well, let me just actually see what happens with the other side. Okay, so what happens if I use the gun? Oh. It's empty. 
Quick, pretend you were joking. I think he kind of is with that face. Okay, so I guess I'll go the other direction once the prompt shows up. There we go. Why is he running like Naruto? Okay, so now what? There's the diamond! Huh. Okay, so I got the Metroid Baby. I got Gordon Freeman's Crowbar. Ash's Pokeball. Or Mario's Super Mushroom. Actually, we do have a picture of Luigi over here in the corner here, so... Hmm. Let's try the Metroid Baby. Maybe he'll have something to do. Go! Sick him! Never mind. Looks like they don't take kindly to orders. Well, I'm not Samus Aran, so that's probably doesn't help. Okay, fine. Pokeball. Wonder what type of Pokemon he has. Night guards, Tim and Joe would like to battle. They sent out Joe. Go missing no sh Oh. Um. Missing number broke my game. So, okay, now you know, don't use a glitched Pokemon to ever battle. It will end terror horribly. <laughs> okay, fine. Crowbar. <laughs> Headcrabs! Where are they all coming from? Why does that always happen? Now you know how Gordon Freeman feels. All right, fine, super mushroom. Oh, now you're in for it. Henry Smash! Hey, look, a dinosaur egg. That shouldn't happen. It should be just a big old rock. Ah! Well, this is chaos. Uh-oh. Somewhere in the Midwest, Center for Chaos Containment. Uh, sir? Y you might want to come look at this. I'm getting chaos readings at 10.6. It's coming from the museum. My god. It's over nine? Yeah. Nine thousand? I'm leaving this decision up to you, Corporal. Just hit one of those buttons to deal with this pressing situation. Who's watching TV? Get back to work! Oh. Okay. So, I got the option. Let's see. I have either this, 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 or this. Hmm. I guess we can always nuke it. That's one way to deal with a jewel thief. Don't feel too bad. He probably camped for the 25 kills he needed to get that nuke. Okay. So, a satellite then? He's a fire and his laser! I couldn't resist. I'm sure you couldn't, buddy. Alright, fine. What about this gear here? A robot? Seriously? With a chainsaw? That's pretty badass, not gonna lie. And we got dubstep in the background too, even better. Hey, you didn't grab the diamond! You just got the hell out of there. Keep going, Henry, go! Did you do it? Did you win? Uh, oh! Well, that's convenient. After all that, I still get the damn diamond, and I won the epic way. Because I am epic. Well, actually, let's just see what the last one is, just because I'm a little curious.
Sorry, I just went to the bathroom. What about, where did, where is everyone? Okay. Well, I guess the only thing left now is to go in full guns blazing and not sneak in. So let's see where that goes. Let's bust it, baby. Vroom, vroom. Oh God, it's a scooter. Wow, you're off to a great start. Hint, you gotta use the keyboard for this part. Right. Okay, jumping doesn't work. Jumping off a speeding vehicle may not be the best idea. Yeah, you tell me. It looks cool in the movies. Fine, I'll just ram them in. They're just like, Whoa. what? Uh, we got a breach headed towards the medieval section. Uh, roger that. We're preparing to engage over. Damn. All right, fine. I'm gonna lance it. Never mind. Good thing the janitors just got done buffing the floor. Could you imagine all the germs you'd be rolling in right now if they hadn't? Well, actually, let's just see what happens if I kick them really quickly. Okay, well, you got one of the guards. Okay. Alright, fine. So, a shield. That should not work! Alright, uh, a basket. Nope, too top heavy. Ah, Torque. I bet you wish you paid more attention to physics class now, huh? Actually, let's just see what happens if I go with the mace. No. Stop hanging around and do something. <laughs> Get it? Okay, I'll stop. Actually, did I actually see... I didn't actually use the lance now that I think of it. Justin, it's harder than it looks. Alright, let's actually get to where we need to be. Alright, tow cable. And after that, they just stopped and arrested him. Whoa, really? Yeah, that's when I decided I should probably get a different job. I figured night garden is much less dangerous than driving a... Yeah, I was kind of interested in what you were saying, but nope, okay. Oh jeez, I got two stars! This is a problem. Branch! Oh. I can see all those hours of video game playing has really sharpened your reflexes. Oh, wait. Thanks, dude. Rock? No, Johnny! No, I'll avenge you! Apparently, a rock is enough to kill an officer in this situation. A bubble? Where did he get the bubble? Uh oh. Bridge is out. There was no road signs of anything. Place your hands where I can see them. Bye. <sighs> well, I lived. And I got me my diamond. Yeah, that was the aggressive way, too. Interesting. Actually, I'm kind of curious to see where the other bit goes, so. Why don't I check that out while I'm at it? Place your hands where I can see them. If you do not comply, I will- Driving doesn't work. I don't think they're gonna get very far that way. Fair enough. Let me go back and see what happens if I did things a little differently. Or I used the branch instead. <laughs> well, I got away, but, uh... I didn't get the diamond. Didn't really think that one through, did ya? Not really, no. All right, sticky grenade. Never mind, it's too sticky. I always wondered how those things work. Not very well, apparently. Wow! Apparently, you're the sniper from Team Fortress 2. Boom headshot, indeed. Sir, place your hands where I can see them. If you do. Hi. Bribery is a federal offense, sir. Oh, okay. Strange. That usually works. It does? I don't know. That doesn't Sir, seem like it works. Place would. your hands where I can see them. If you do. 
Bye. Alright, well, I guess that was all the options I could take through this whole thing. So, there we go. That was stealing a diamond. Definitely a lot more intense than the last two. He's definitely uh, seeing the progression of the different endings and different scenarios and humor you can get with this. It's really cool to see where it comes from. Alright, that's another one in the Henry Stickman series. I guess we'll be seeing what's going to happen next time in the next game of this strange and... Uh, clever little Flash game series, but for now, this is uh, Princess HLC saying thank you very much for watching, and have a fond farewell.